I'm Kimberly Kay with your entertainment report. In response to Taylor Swift's open letter to Apple criticizing the company's three-month free trial for their music streaming service, during which time the company would not be paying artists for their music, Apple's senior vice president of internet software and services, Eddie Q, took to Twitter on Sunday to tell Swift that he understands her complaints and that Apple has decided to change the way they pay and compensate artists. Caitlyn Jenner and her children were all smiles on Father's Day as they went off-roading together as a family. Dinner's over, Hannibal fans. The NBC series is only three episodes into its third season so far, but don't expect a fourth Cannibal course. On Monday, NBC canceled the show in a death so grisly that even Mads Mikkelsen's Hannibal Lecter wouldn't approve. It's no news that Hannibal is one of the most graphic shows on network television, with some of the most gruesome death scenes shown on the small screen. While it has been critically praised, the show has also suffered from consistent low ratings even into the current third season. Holly Madison is opening up about the shocking allegations she makes against Playboy's Hugh Hefner in her new book, Down the Rabbit Hole, Curious Adventures and Cautionary Tales of a Former Playboy Bunny. In the tell-all, the 35-year-old former Playboy Bunny details the reported emotional abuse she says she endured while living with the 89-year-old Hefner. She alleges that the first time she met Hef, he offered her drugs. At one point, she says she even felt suicidal. Hefner has since denied the allegations, exclusively telling Entertainment Tonight that his ex has decided to rewrite history in an attempt to stay in the spotlight. That's your latest entertainment report. I'm Kimberly Kay for HVNN.com.